it's a Twisters, Twisters, Twisters. We're watching. We watched Twisters. Oh, and you, and you. Or the way I like to call it, Glenn Powell and Tornadoes. <laughs> Glenn Powell. Easy, easy. That's all it is. It's, it's, the movie really. Uh, he is. He's doing good work right now. He's doing good work from that. What movie? The the, the assassin movie that he is. That where he pretends to be the, is a killer. Hitman. He, the Hitman. Hitman. The one on Netflix. Hitman, one on Netflix. Mm-hmm. Um, and to, from that one to anyone but you, and now Twisters. Oh, yeah, great movie. Great. Oscar nominated. Uh, no, Top Gun Maverick. Yeah, Top Maverick Gun. was pretty good. Spy He's, Kids uh, three. Wait, what? He was in. He was in that one show. Wait, was he one uh, of the kids? Yeah, he was one of the kids in Spy Kids. Hilarious. Spy Kids three D, the one with Stallone. He's been working. Uh, been working a long time. Now he's like really uh, jacked. Huh? What? Ripped. No, he's like really making a presence now. Bang and Cindy Sweeney. He's like he's like if if uh, Matthew Allegedly. McConaughey. He's if the he he's, could... he's the one boyfriend. He's the one that boyfriends need to be need to be scared of because the way he the way he holds his co stars in non movie parts like in during the interviews or like in the mm-hmm. red carpet. Tom Cruise. Like, Oh, sus. Uh-huh. <laughs> he was holding Tom Cruise's hand. They were skipping. He cut his buttock. This is not a sequel. I thought it was a sequel to the to the Bill Paxton Helen Hunt movie where she was banging the quadriplegic or whatever it was. But that's not the right movie. Wait, that's not <laughs> Twisters? No. Whoops. I forgot no, the uh, movie that was. That was uh... The Sessions. The Sessions. Trust me. It's The Sessions. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, I, I watched the wrong movie. Well, they do the twisters like this. <laughs> Never. Mind. It's Indian burn. It's Indian burn, right? Indian burn. Um, but this is not a sequel. This is not. I thought it was going to be a sequel. I thought we were going to get at least because uh, I I knew nothing about it. I didn't go. I didn't go in to do any research before I saw this movie. I thought it was a it was a direct sequel to. Uh, it feels, the it feels like a standalone movie. A standalone movie. It is. A, it is a hundred percent a standalone. The only. The only. There's the a bunch of nods movie. to the uh, original. There was only one. Name nod. one. Dorothy. The Dorothy. That's it. The Dorothy. Okay. Name another the one. Only nod. That's it. There was no cows. There was no cows flying across the screen. Yeah, no you cows. don't give me one cow. There's a lot of fucking it's cows not, there. It's not a direct sequel, but it's part of the same universe. I mean, tornadoes well, are just everywhere. It, it could no, be. It's not they, based on this universe. But they don't really connect like anything other than the Dorothy. Like, and they don't. They said they they made it seem like they're the ones that created the Dorothy. So I'm not sure. No, I don't think so. They, that's what it made it seem because they didn't explain like, oh, we got this from this. They well, made it they no, yeah. the same the same uh, same things that they used in the in the last one. Yeah, mm-hmm. but that's it. It's just all. Oh, yeah, it's the Yato, only. Yeah, I, I, I thought that I, at least somebody was going to be the kid of somebody, like at least the Bill Paxton reference. Maybe he was going to stand like awkwardly, like in the Twisters ride when it was at Universal's Orlando. She kept yeah, saying, I'm, "I'm not back. I'm not back." Bill Paxton kept saying, it's over, man. I got a little dick. Oh, no, that's a different movie. <laughs> that sounds familiar. Uh, yeah, no, but I, I, I would I would have thought that there was going to be some sort of at least non-mentions or something about the original, but no. No, no. It's, it's its own thing. I mean, and I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it. It's just mm-hmm. uh, it it was just dumb, dumb twister fun. It was very country. Everything was country music. It was very, but it it was very alike to the first one. Like it, yeah. it was like beat for beat at a yeah. point, and then it From just. The beginning, uh, we were we were uh, we were watching it. Ozzy and I were, or, or Doctor Oz and I were watching it at the movie theater, and we're um the beginning. Every, when everything starts happening, I'm like, oh yeah, it's gonna happen. Yeah. Uh-huh. Right away, I'm like, it's gonna be exactly like the fir- like the original, the way it starts yeah. to the way it ends. Uh, and we're I mean, it for, has uh, it shows it shows that tornadoes are American. <laughs> That's what this USA, movie shows. USA, uh, yeah, yeah, but uh, I, I think oh, the movie fine, is saved. I think the movie is saved by the chemistry that Glenn Powell has with Daisy. And, yeah, well, yeah, general in general with his female co stars. Uh, no, he's like he's like if if uh, if Matthew McConaughey was well spoken. <laughs> There Perhaps. is that comparison. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's like he doesn't have to go all right, all right, all right, and then he just says, "Okay." You, you're fifty percent <laughs> right. Yeah. Most. 
<laughs> but like in in the original, what they were doing is what they were sending the Dorothy to study the inside of the tornado, right? Yeah, that's what they were doing. And this one, they are trying to figure out how to dissolve a tornado before it can cause destruction. That's the end goal of the of of this group in this one. Now what they need to learn is that nature always finds a way. They should always just have that in every movie that has to do with mm. natural disasters. Every universal every, every movie. Universal movie. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is Universal Warner Brothers, right? Yeah. This is both of them. This is Universal Warner Brothers collab. Uh, it, but I, 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 I'm not going to say this. All, I'm not going to say this is a horrible movie. It's not a horror movie. It's, it's, it's not it's a, a bad movie. movie. It's a, it's a movie. fun movie. And I, it's, it's re- it really is saved by the chemist by Glenn, Glenn Powell. Uh, uh, because there's certain part, parts of the movie where I was like, it it can get boring. This movie can get boring if if they didn't cut if if they didn't trim it. It's two hours long. The movie's two hours long, but it could have gotten boring. It 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 rode the line, like right when they're explaining, like the uh, the whole um, uh, like how, what what her study was before, and they're trying to go when he when they visited her mom's home. Mm-hmm. He got a little bit kind of like talky, and I was like, "Come on, no, less talky, more tornadoy." And what they did is that whole alluding to the mom on the phone, and a lot of times I was like, "Oh, it's gonna be uh, Helen Hunt. Oh, it's yeah, gonna be yeah. Helen Hunt." Yeah, because she came in the shadows, and also, oh, and it was not. It was it was was it what's her name? Tierney from was it? Yeah, Mara Tierney. Which I'm like, okay, cool. She's not in the first one. You could have got Jamie Gertz. She was in the first one. She could have been the mom. Jamie Philip Seymour Hoffman. You could have gotten, yeah. yeah this she one, she ended, up, she ended up working in the ER for some reason. <clears throat> they didn't. No, no one watched ER? Fuck you guys. You know <laughs> how long ago that was? <laughs> yeah. George Clooney, Noah Weil, they were on ER. Okay. Cool. So was, so uh, Hel- you know what? You know what? Helen Hunt was in the sessions. So was Gilbert, <laughs> huh? What? I don't know. Gilbert, who? Godfrey? <laughs> no, Gilbert, nerds. Oh. Goose? Anthony Edwards. Goose? Anthony Ed- Goose? There's a connection. ER to Anthony Edwards. Goose was in Top Gun. Who was in Top Gun Maverick? Done. Tom Cruise. And Glenn Powell. Oh, okay. So. Glenn Powell. Uh, but really, like the movie, majority of the movie is. There, there is no villain other than the tornadoes in this movie. That's what it is. Like even no, then there was no the although the, you do. I mean, they're star, not, they're not villains. Arc. They're not, uh, yeah, they're not villains with Where's Superman. No man, you, you mean with Superman? That's the new Superman too. Yeah, the the the, the other guy in Storm Par with uh, Usnavi. When they said his name, I was like, bro, they <laughs> called him Usnavi in this movie too, but it was Javi. Ninety six thousand. What? Um, watch, watch the heights. Yeah. In the heights. And uh, but yeah, no, don't, it's don't. It's a great. There movie. was no like the yeah. I mean, they were doing. They were still. They were still chasing tornadoes, chasing tornadoes. But it was just for the wrong reasons. They weren't causing the tornadoes. The still the the major villain of the movie is that is the tornadoes, right? That's what it was. And then actually, uh, tornadoes actually the uh, the. Big bad in this movie? Oh, oh shit. come on! <laughs> but I, but I will. Uh, but I, I, again, I, I'll say that it's not a horrible movie. It's not the. It's not like Academy Award winning or anything. Special effects aren't are, you know, they're not horrible either. Uh, everyone's likable in this movie. Everyone, even even to even the bad guys, right? Uh, but ultimately, See, the movie so there is are very, bad guys. The tornadoes. Even ultimately, at the end of the movie. <laughs> At the end of the movie, the movie, the movie is Glenn Powell and Daisy Edgar Jones's movie. It's them, their their um, chemistry. And, and, and like Superman was involved in a real estate scam. That's true. I didn't like the beginning because I thought it was too much, too alike to the original. But then, yeah, it uh, towards the end you start having a lot more fun. You're like, you, but you have to kind of disconnect. It's because it's just okay. We're just here to have fun. Let's let's try to have some fun, and then boom. The CGI it was great, by the way. Dolby, if you're watching in Dolby, I do oh, watch it. You know what that sound in Dolby was. Well, you gotta, re- you gotta remember. It was 1996. Like, yeah, yeah, so yeah, 90s. I know, but you watch 96 now, and it's like, ooh, 
compare comparison. Oh yeah. They had diff- and they had different types of twisters. They had that fire twister, the one that became that big one towards the, the end. Rig. Yeah. And they had, they had that one. They had the one at the beginning, which someone should superimpose Kevin Costner before they run in, un, under the the freeway to just do this. <laughs> they should Don't put him. In what the fuck? Because look, you get Superman, then you can get Kevin Costner in this movie. It's Man of Steel too. Done. Yeah. Perfect. But well, yeah, so no, already I, in it. I know, that's what I'm saying. That's what he just said. That's why I still take a shot. Dun, 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 dun. Fat, fat, fat. And he's wearing a little My Little Pony shirt. Uh-huh. <laughs> unicorn, sir. Unicorn. I, I did like the. I, I did find it interesting. It kind of slowed down uh, towards where you know where they end up going back to her mom's house and all this stuff, and then they started to go like. I, I guess when he banged her, he banged her. The mom or her? Or the, the, mom, the mom. He totally did. Probably did. He gave her a shirt. Yeah. <laughs> and an STD. Maybe. Uh, <laughs> here's here's a UTI as well. But bam. Throw in there. Juice of cranberry juice. <laughs> Throws a shirt and a bottle of cranberry juice. Had a man. That's how he does. That's his, that's his calling card, his signature. <laughs> After he's what, was the, what was his signature? <laughs> what was it that he said in the. Did this? Yeah. Oh, he said. That's, that's my favorite move. No, oh, gross. <laughs> That's Disgusting. how I roll, son. <laughs> I, go, I, go, I, go, I, go, I go like this. I go like this. Yeah. Lubrication. <laughs> KY jelly. The only jelly I put on my toast. What? What? Um, but I but yeah, like yeah, you do have to just disconnect from this movie and you like disconnect from re- from reality and just, just have fun with this movie. This is just a summer movie. This is just a, it's, it's a it's just a cement is meant to be a fun movie. Not it gonna is, be the the summer blockbuster. No, 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 no. But it's it's fun, yeah. I agree. But, it, it's, like, it's, but I agree. It's a, it's a Shakespearean version of Sharknado. But I do, I do <laughs> agree. I do agree with you that the beginning is there's parts where it, if they could if they dragged it out, it could have been very very slow and it could have gotten very very boring. Uh, but luckily, the chemistry between the leads kind of saved it. And it's not just two leads. You also have Anthony Ramos in there too, with his real, conflict, though? where he was in. Uh, you could tell he, uh, of course, he was in love with. Uh, he was in love with uh, the Helen Hunt character. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Joe. Uh, yeah, with so the, he was. Yeah, Kate. they were. Kate. Kate. Joe is Helen Hunt. Well, same thing. Uh, yeah, but but uh, you could tell they just didn't they didn't explore that that much and. Then she ends up with the Glenn Powell character, which is Tyler, right? Mm. Tyler, the, uh, the 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 destroyer, the rand the wrangler, and uh, yeah, but really, really, ultimately, at the end of it, it's 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 a fine it's it's a fine movie. It's a fine summer movie um, that is carried because of the fact that uh, the leads are good in it, and the special effects aren't bad. And if you watch it in if you watch it in Adobe or IMAX, you're gonna get this amazing sound because but they really, I think, they really I, think a lot of they, work that. I don't think it was filmed in uh in I think it was filmed with 30 uh 35 millimeter yeah yeah but they I, didn't use I, digital I think, I think IMAX might not be that great for it but I think <clears> I think Dolby would just because uh sound and everything would actually work out well both Dolby and IMAX have real great sound like and again there's times where I used to watch movies that were non IMAX movies filmed in normal um aspect and it's, yeah i watch i watch old eight millimeter films too I mean, what's on it was still it was still good like watching it with the sound and everything i think that this is the kind of movie you would want to watch in a the theater just because of how loud it is i'm curious because i hear a lot of good things about watching this movie in 4dx oh because really? yeah because your seat moves you get the you you get like, being, what, a wind. universal right now wind and water yeah pretty much a two-hour universal ride right just not as intense but i hear good things about watching it in 4dx Ooh, imagine watching a d-box that's what 4dx is it's a, it's a mix of d-box with that kind of stuff so <laughs> d-box would be just spitting on you mm. on your face so you can feel the rain it's the wrong theater you're in <laughs> all right all right <laughs> quit spitting on me sir it's too dark but i did, but i did notice i did notice when the movie Why was do over i need a blindfold huh i didn't know who wrote it and it was joseph kaczynski the guy who shows up in the the guy who directed was Bomber? It, Top Gun Top Gun Maverick, the guy who did the other movie with Tom Cruise, the guy who did Tron Legacy. He wrote he wrote the movie. He didn't direct it, but he wrote it. Someone wrote this. They just go like, uh, hey, we need to put a bunch of actors in the middle of uh, some green screen. Let's go. Ted Kaczynski wrote this. 
No, Joseph Kaczynski. Uh, sure, written by Joseph Gordon Levitt. Got you. Is there a moment where you can't be stupid? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I was born to sway. Hashtag born to sway. Lazy Lady Gaga. <laughs> All right. Um, <laughs> and that song is actually uh, like you can tell it's a different. It's a Madonna song too. It's like wait a minute, what? It's not the not the point. So like Twisters, a similarity <laughs> to the original. Twister. Twister. All Twister. right. <laughs> Just get a salt and pepper. I I, I recommend this movie. I it's do fun. too. I, it's I fun do if you just want to watch something silly. Yeah, yeah, something fun. I I enjoyed it. I like yeah. this week. It's not it's not the greatest, but it's 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 a fun watch. It's good. It's a good. It's a good time to spend out of this heat. And mm-hmm. you're not gonna you're not gonna you're not going to regret watching this movie. You saw yeah. it, and, oh. and you seen Glenn Powell's butt too. Not Same. Wow. What? what? No, not this one. No. I, I Same. Was picturing it. Okay, fine. Same formula as the original, but. But it worked. But it worked. Yeah, it works. it worked. Don't um, break. No, it's yeah, better. Yeah. It's better than Madam Web. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cool. Better still better. Madam still better CGI than the Flash. On that note, this has been Vinny. Sorry. Anna. We'll see you guys next time.